When talking about controversial treatments, this one would have to be the most exciting of them all. Can energy waves help treat depression? For people that have become resistant to antidepressant drugs, could magnetic therapy be the solution to pull their brain out of the darkness? Depression is one of the most common mental health problems, with one in four Australians experiencing it at least once in their lifetime. Depression doesn't discriminate. It can affect any person at any stage of their life. Everyone has feelings of sadness or low mood at different points throughout their lives, particularly during times of stress or loss. But if the low mood persists for longer than two weeks and is accompanied by other symptoms such as loss of interest in activities, loss of energy, changes in appetite or sleep, feelings of guilt, worthlessness or hopelessness, and poor concentration, an episode of major depression may be diagnosed. Depression is commonly treated with medication and psychotherapy. However, some people may have adverse effects to medication or be resistant to them. This is where alternative treatments such as transcranial magnetic stimulation could be a viable solution. Here at South Coast Private, we have introduced TMS, transcranial magnetic stimulation, which uses pulse magnetic energy to stimulate and reset neurons in the brain. I've experienced depression for just over two years now. The treatments I've tried are long-term psychology consultation and some medication as well. The first time I heard of RTMS was when I came to an appointment with my psychiatrist and he was explaining that it might be for me. Oh, it's very non-invasive, it doesn't hurt at all, it was, in fact sometimes you feel like you're going to go to sleep with the, <laughs> while you're um, on the chair and yeah, it was, it was fine, it's, it's not difficult at all. South Coast Private, situated in the heart of the New South Wales South Coast, is an exclusive private mental health facility in Wollongong supporting patients in their treatment, recovery, and overall mental health and wellbeing. So South Coast Private is a, a private mental health facility, 90 beds. Uh, we've been in Wollongong for five years now. We offer a range of um, psychological treatments for our patients under the care of um, local psychiatrists. We treat uh, mood and anxiety, uh, post-traumatic stress disorder, and substance abuse issues. Um, more recently, we've, um, we've brought TMS into the range of treatments that we provide. And Kim, what made you decide to bring a treatment like TMS to the South Coast? There's a huge amount of research out there that shows TMS is very effective in the treatment of depression. We really wanted to bring this to our community. Uh, TMS is being offered in Sydney and across Australia, but not in Wollongong and it was very important that we provided this specialised treatment for our patients. TMS has been controversial. It is orthodox and it is revolutionary, but it has fast become one of the most successful treatments for depression. And with me now is Dr. Erwin Pakula, Chief Medical Superintendent here at South Coast Private Hospital. Dr. Pakula, can you please explain to us how Repetitive Transcranial Magnetic Stimulation Therapy, or RTMS, actually works. The RTMS therapy works essentially by utilising a large magnet on the head. As you can see here, we have a machine that has two coils. Electricity is passed through these coils and a magnetic um, field is created which passes right through the bone and the skin into the brain and then passes on a small electrical current into the deeper parts of the brain. This is the part of the brain that is affected called the limbic system. And because of the effect of the electricity, it stimulates an increase in motivation. The neurotransmitters are increased and in fact, in some areas of the brain, research has showed that there's an increase in the number of um, nerve cells that are, are produced in that part of the brain. I'm here now with Andre Fundamerva, the TMS 
coordinator here at South Coast Private Hospital and with the beautiful Deb, who's going to be our patient today. Thanks for being with us, Deb. Okay. Now, I'm very excited, Andre, if you could please show us how the whole procedure works. Um, so basically with an RTMS treatment, we're treating a certain area of the brain called dorsolateral prefrontal cortex. But for us to find that area, we use a computer program that was designed by William Bean. So what we do initially is we get um, three measurements. We get a nasium to inian measurement, we get a tragus to tragus measurement, and we get the circumference of the head around the, the widest point of the head, and we punch those figures into a computer program, and that computer program then gives us numbers that we then mark out onto the head. Those measurements are then taken from the vertex or the center of the head and measured down towards what they call an x-axis, which sits just above the eyebrow over there. So now we have the coil sitting tangential to the head. We have it lined up with the front of the template mark over there. And basically we can start one of our treatments. So what we're gonna to do today is just do what, do what they call two trains. So it's gonna run for four seconds, rest for 25 seconds, and run for four more seconds. And you can see how the treatment is going. So it's gonna go in three, two, and one. Rest for 25 seconds. And can you feel these pulses, Deb, when they come through? Yeah, you can. It's just like a little bird pecking on your head, but it doesn't hurt. Okay, lovely. <laughs> so, Kim, for someone who is interested in TMS, how might they apply? They can go on our website, they could go and see their GP, uh, they could ring our friendly intake staff on 1800 250 000. they could see one of our psychiatrists and they'll be able to find out a lot of information and also how they could refer to the service.